If you have pursued your bachelor's or master's in bioinformatics and now looking for a job in the field, so here are some jobs that you can actually get after pursuing bioinformatics degree or course. So the topic for today's discussion will be the types of jobs that you can get after you have pursued your bioinformatics degree or course. So let's start with the topic and with the very first opportunity that you will have. Coming to the very first opportunity that you will have is bioinformatics analyst. And if you see, what are the job duties of this analyst? So if you are appointing for this role, you will have to perform research. So the main duty is to conduct research, develop informatics algorithms and also creating databases. So these are the job duties for bioinformatics analyst. Now, what is the requirement? If you have done your master's degree or PhD, then you are good to go for this uh, you can say field or for this post. Now, what is the salary? If you appoint for this, you will get according to Indian rupee, it is five to six lakhs per annum. Now, coming to the second job role that is about software developer. Now, we'll see the job duties. If you're appointing for this role, you will have to work for software development and related tools. Also, you have to build for some computational tools. Now, what is the requirement for this uh, degree? It is bachelor's degree or master's degree in biology bioinformatics, biostatistics, and computer science. So if you have pursued your bachelor's or master's degrees in all these fields, then you are good to go for this software development. And the salary that you will get according to Indian rupee, it is eight to 10 lakhs per annum. And the third job role, it is about database programmer where you have to develop computer programs and you have to create codes for programming. And the requirement for this type of job is bachelor's degree in related field and programming language means you have to complete your bachelor's degree. And if you have master's degree, then you can go for this database programmer as well. And also you need to have uh, an idea about or experience about programming languages such as PL, SQL coding. So if you are knowing all these languages, then you can go and appoint yourself as a database programmer where you will get a salary of 3.6 to 4 lakhs per annum. Coming to the fourth job role that is about pharmacogenomics where an individual works for the response of drug to an individual. Suppose if any drug is designed, so bioinformatician or jo Field may come curtain that is pharmacogenomics. They will work to study the response of the drug that is applied to an individual, or you can say that is given to an individual. Now, what is the requirement for this job post? It is bachelor's or master's degree. So, if you have bachelor's or master's degree in the related field, you can go for this field. And also, you should have certification course. Now, what is the certification course that is needed for pharmacogenomics? It is 16 R Rx genomics program. So if you have this certification program, you can go and appoint for this post. What is the salary that you will get after this job? It is 3 to 3.5 lakhs per annum. Now the fifth job role that you will have is bioinformatics engineer where you have to create bioinformatics tools or you can simply call it as computational tools. Now what is the requirement that is needed for this kind of uh, post? It is master's degree but you should have hard skills like Q SQL as well as Perl and computational and statistical knowledge is required and also a good knowledge for data maze is important. So if you have all these hard skills so you are Good to go for this bioinformatics engineer. Now, what is the salary that you will get after you appoint for this post? It is six to seven lakhs per annum. So now here we have discussed five roles, five jobs. That is bioinformatics analyst, where you need to have master's degree or PhD, and the package will be five to six lakh per annum. Second is software developer, where you need to have bachelor's or master's degree. So if you have done your bioinformatics in all these fields that is mentioned here for the second post, so you are good to go for this software development and, and here and here you will get 8 to 10 lakhs per annum. The third post that we have discussed here is database programmer where you need to have bachelor's degree and you will have a package of 3.6 to 4 lakhs per annum. So you can see here only bachelor's degree is needed right and if you are appointing for this post right after bachelor's so you will have 3.6 to 4 lakhs per annum. Coming to pharmacogenomics where you have to learn about the response of drug that is given to an individual for this you need to have bachelor's or master's degree along with the certification course that we have discussed and the salary here will be 3 to 3.5 lakh per annum. Coming to the fifth opportunity that you will have is bioinformatics engineer where you have to co create computational tools and the salary will be 6 to 7 lakhs per annum. Coming to the sixth job role or opportunity so that is about lecturer or professor. So if you have any passion in teaching so you can go for 
uh, teaching line also and you can appoint yourself as lecturer or professor. So job duties will be academic career at host institutions where requirement is needed like masters in bioinformatics. And if you've completed masters, the net qualification is mandatory. Like you all know, as per GOI norms, uh, assistant professor, it is mandatory to have CSI at LS. So if you are having net qualification at least LS, then you can go for this lecturer or professor job. And also if you have PhD in bioinformatics and if you want to go for this lecturer or professor job, then you can go. And the salary for this type of post is according to Indian rupee, that is 8 to 9 lakhs per annum. So if you want, this is actually a good job and you can see package is also very good. So you can go for this field. Coming to the seventh job opportunity, that is about microbiologists. Now, many of you may be thinking about why microbiologists is mentioned here. So, uh, you can see bioinformatician, they work along with microbiologists and they actually help microbiologists in their work. So, I mentioned here microbiologists where they aid or help microbiologists in their conducting experiments, in analyzing data and everything. Now, let's see what is the role of microbiologists or bioinformatician that is working in the field of microbiologists. So, their job duty is to help microbiologists to study pattern, display data and publication. Like we all know, we have to publish our research, right? Once we establish novel finding. So, in that case, if you want to display data and if you want to present data in that publication journal, so in that case, bioinformatician is helping them to display all their data. Now, what is the requirement if you have done your master's and if you are having experience or if you have done PhD, then you are good to go for this microbiologist field where you actually need to help microbiologists in their role. And the salary that you will get, get here is four to five lakhs per annum. Coming to the eighth job role that is about molecular biologists. Here also by informatician, they help molecular biologists in their experiments and their job duties is to analyze text, images or sound files that can help to generate results from large sets of raw data. So as you all know that many different data will be generated while we are working on experiments. So that time, if they need to analyze their data uh, in a short period of time, so bioinformatician, they are helping molecular biologists in their role. And the requirement that is needed is master's degree along with experience. Also, you need to have PhD degree. And if you are appointing yourself for this role, the salary will be four to five lakhs per annum. So you have this opportunity as well. So coming to the ninth opportunity, or you can say the job profile that is about computational biologists. And the duty of computational biologists is to computational management, means they have to manage everything, statistical process, and also they have to deal with biological data. And the requirement that is needed for this type of job role is doctoral degree, where you need to complete a PhD in bioinformatics, and the salary will be around 10 to 11 lakhs per M. Now you can see if doctor Doctoral degree is needed and the salary is also increased. So we started with bachelor's and master's and now we are ending with doctoral degree. And the last opportunity that you that I have mentioned and you will have in this field is bioinformatics research scientist. Now this is the ultimate post. Now you can see what is the job duties using computational tools to study biological data means you have to use computational tools and you have to learn and study about biological data, its processes, everything. Now what is the requirements? PhD along with experience. Now here we have mentioned doctoral degree for computational biologists. Now here you can see you need PhD along with experience where you will have a salary or package of 11 to 20 lakhs per annum. So here we discuss all the job roles that you will have after pursuing bioinformatics degree. Either you have completed your bachelor's bioinformatics, master bioinformatics or related field or if you have done your doctoral degree. So here we started with bachelor's degree. We started with analyst. We started with software developer, database programmer. We have seen pharmacogenomics. We have seen bioinformatics engineer, lecturer, professor, microbiologist, molecular biologist, computational biologist as well as research scientist. So this is all about the job profiles that one can have after pursuing this relative field. So I hope this information was helpful for all of you. And if you find this information was helpful, do subscribe to our channel that is Biotechnica. Need to back again in the next video. Till next time, this is your host Ria. Thank you everyone. Keep learning.